A man attempting to rob a jewelry store is shot by an employee inside. It was all captured on surveillance cameras inside and outside of that store. CBS 2's Asal Rezai reports from Jewelers Row in the loop. Chicago police covering two crime scenes in this area. It started at this jewelry store behind me. The suspect running out after being shot and then making his way up to those stairs up to the CTA platform. <coughs> A usually busy Saturday morning in the loop turns chaotic at 1 North Wabash Avenue just before 11 o'clock. Police lights quickly taking over the scene. Crime tape also blocking off parts of the CTA platform just steps away. Surveillance video from inside the store shows the suspect wearing a red sweatshirt, walking around for about a minute before he takes off running towards the entrance. In this closer angle, you can see him begin to bash in a glass case. That's when the employee at the far left reaches behind the counter, begins shooting at the suspect before he tries to get away. Footage from outside the store shows him stumbling out, then running back in to grab what appears to be a small bag before he takes off up the CTA stairs. Police say shortly after, he was placed into custody and taken to the hospital for a gunshot wound. They say he is in stable condition. We're told the employee is a Foyd card holder. But I think to just throw it all on the all on the responsibility of the business owners or the residences is really not the right way to go. Christine has lived in a neighboring building for about 14 years. She says she wants to see more police in the area as she's concerned with the recent spike in crime she's seen. But the crime is just escalating and it's getting worse and worse. We had kids killed a few weeks ago. Now this armed robbery or at least a, a gun was involved at some point. Um, but it's, um, it's a shame. It's a shame. I'm told by security inside the employee that opened fire is currently in custody as Chicago police continue their investigation. At this time, charges against the robbery suspect are pending. I'm reporting in the loop. Asal Rezai, CBS 2 News.